This is not financial advice. It's not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all YouTube algorithm stuff. So you get the videos I put them out. So you don't think it's him analyzing that data. But like I tell y'all every day, the day they release us is false. Money gives a false narrative market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, according to Ortex, the cost to borrow max is 855%. That is an absolutely outrageous number. And the cost to borrow average is running about 632%. Do you know how much it's costing the small sh shorters to maintain their position? It is expensive as hell. And I believe, and it's just, just my opinion, some of these shorters might have relationships with the big dogs where they're actually getting these counterfeit shares for free because we all know, we all know there's no AMC shares, no real ones anyway, left to borrow. Based on everything I've seen over the last 18 months, there are no real AMC shares left to borrow. So all we have is those counterfeit shares with those fair to the livers that they keep pushing into the market. And there's a distinct possibility that some of the market makers are giving these shares to the smaller hedge funds or if they borrowed them from brokers, the larger hedge funds, the larger, larger hedge funds or market makers might be paying their cost to borrow rate. And the reason I believe that is this. If the smaller hedge funds start to cover, that will push AMC and 8 through the roof. And that would force the big dogs to have to cover or close out their positions at a way higher price. So I believe... And, and I don't want to say conspiracy, but I believe they're conspiring together not to close their position to stop AMC from running. But like I told y'all in the previous video, I don't think any of that really matters because even though the SEC refused to do their job, DDCC refused to do their job, FINRA refused to do their job, I believe that the market is going to get justice for us. The market always adjusts itself in my opinion and their liquidity is drying up their collateral is gone they'll be forced to sell their longs and then amc and gme should go to the moon and i believe we're gonna squeeze whether sec does their job or not hopefully we squeeze before that that march 14th vote so that way the vote won't even be necessary anyway please leave some comments tell me what you think do you think 855% cost to borrow is extremely high. And could that help us, Moaz? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.